speed golf analysis on the euro versus the pound. Let's not waste any time. This looks like a beautiful setup. I've been watching this thing. Uh, there was a breakout trade from this channel down in here. It's a beautiful top bottom here that uh, on the daily if you missed it. Oh well. It's not too late to board the train. Beautiful setup down here in the corner. Internal top bottom entry, low risk. Um, after this rally, you place your uh, penny buy limit here with a stop down here. And then you have your, uh, you know, you can take about 50 off the table. Another chance to get on and run even a tighter stop. Um, this is the daily. When you took out this, um, I'd be taking some profits at this doji. And then let rest run up into here. And this is where you have the reversals. You have sell limits here. Uh, sell limits because of this. You wouldn't have got filled, but uh, the sell limit at, at the uh, just nearly the, uh, the even number was here. So if you did the stop punt entry where you know there's stops here. You might, you might have got filled. Not on this broker, maybe. But it's okay, because even if you didn't capture the reversal on there, which was kind of nice, I guess if you had the... Uh, yeah, the, the market went, needed to fill this hole here. So after it was satisfied, and after they got the liquidity out of this hole, this is where the liquidity was living. So they cleaned house, they came up here, and uh, of course this is the daily, there's the triangle. You could have had a sell stop this day. There's two days of sell stops there. The conservative uh, breakout traders have a sell stop here, which is the uh, middle of that month. And then we crush back in. And you should be long right now on this pair and have another pending here. So you get in light here. Uh, you got filled. If you're playing uh, this confluence of the trend line break, doesn't mean we can't keep crushing down into here that's why you don't exactly want to load the wagon here this isn't the uh, holy grail move to here this could actually crush back all the way to here and just keep plummeting so and then of course at the, in that case you want to buy you want to basically triple down you want to bet the ranch down in here for a real high probability scalp to here and then of course this could be the bottom bottom and then this thing's gonna go into a ranging mode and then maybe it does eventually go up so and then we go to the four hour to see for a more precision entry um, keeping that same line from the daily see how that has a nice uh, trend line of course the trend line of the daily would have looked a little bit more like this a little snugger uh, you could make the argument you know break it out so I was getting in before that breakout now here's the problem with when you draw trend lines on the wicks you're getting in too late see you, this is this is a one day moving average it's a one period moving average black line and uh, in the four hour since I've gone into six to one resolution there's six uh, six bars on this chart for the one on the daily that's plenty of, plenty of uh, zoom. But this looks like the gold market with this heavy sell-off. You know, this is heavy. But now we have this nice um, anchoring area here for a channel to build a channel now. So we can start thinking in terms of this. And uh, still might get our entry down in here. You know, so definitely have pennings down here there's this high probability come back to this get in